Hello everyone and welcome back another episode of our Road to India Glory career mode guys in, Cri in Cricket Captain 2021 and today we are back again with the Bihar side taking on Tripura. Now the problem with this game against Tripura, look at the fitness levels. Everyone is really really low. I have indeed made some changes as a result but I would just check the fixtures and results and it looks like after the one day trophy we have probably about a two week gap to our first T20 match because the first class stuff doesn't start till December. So as a result of that, I think most of this fitness will go away just in case I ha I've actually tasked a couple of people with sitting out and giving un others a bit of a crack just because of course this game means nothing in our chances for the cup because we are well and truly out. Tripura has to win against us to make the top two, but for us, it means absolutely nothing. So we're gonna try some stuff. I'm gonna try, uh, I'm obviously gonna rest Ranjan and Corey Anderson. Sachin Singh for the first class stuff, mainly Ranjan and Anderson. I'm gonna give Singh a bit of a break to give Cash Yap a game, just to see how he goes, because his stats are not impressive, I have to say. 37 this year, but 27 overall, not very good. Oh, sorry, Nishank Kumar and Indrajit Kumar opening the batting for the first time in their one day careers for a bit of exposure at this level. Cash up in just his second game. Lambert into just his ninth alongside Sarek Martin. Obviously, the experience of Dinesh Kartik will be there. Aman and Quadri will stay in the lineup as well with Martin and Lambert. And Kartik, of course, that makes basically our core five, swapping out everyone else. We have indeed given another game to Sabir Khan after he bowled extremely well in one of the one-day games. It was none for 38. So he's done very well in the second stuff as well, so... Decided to give him a crack opening the bowling. Russell returns to the line as well. It's really experimentational, this game. And uh, it's time to see whether this experimental lineup will be able to create any sort of impact against Tripura going into this game. They've got anyone I can really recognize? Not really. So I'm going to just call heads, as we always do with Bihar. We've won the toss. To be honest, we're average bounce is perfect. It looks cloudy in the second innings, though. Slow outfield. I reckon, we, I reckon we're going to have a bowl first. Let's make sure we get a full bat and a full bowl in this game today. Good start from Sabir Kumar as well. Great shot from Saha through point for four. We do know how good most teams openers should be, because at this stage, we've conceded a lot of runs to opening bats this season and it doesn't look like it's going to change today that's a great shot from Saha for six bone edge great shot from Saha that's going to be four he is flying out the gates that's for sure gonna to have to give Saha a bit of a defensive field but it doesn't help because he's playing some terrific strokes finishes the power play all done and dusted we're going to give Rasul a full bowl today and really see if he's got what it takes at this level 55 for none for Tripura and Rasul strikes, he gets Saha, would you believe it? Well, bold, Pavez Rasul gets his first wicket of the season. Awesome stuff to see, Martin, ooh, in the air. And through square leg for four, Martin to Singer. Through mid wicket, four more. Really does look more and more like Martin is gonna be a batter more than a bowler. Yeah, just doesn't seem to be making the impact that we want him to make throughout the whole season too. Oh, that's a good shot from Kumar. That's going to be four. What can uh, Russell do? Oh, bounces back, but there's no slip. Great shot through the covers, and it will reach the boundary. Going to have Quadri come into the attack for the first time today, and he's got a very aggressive field, have to say. We've got a short leg in play. Oh, he sweeps it past him, though. That would be four. Russell into his sixth. 99 for one. Kumar cuts that away nicely for four. 100 up for Tripura. Just the loss of one wicket, but that could be out. Pavez with his second, you betcha. Rasul with his second. Captain Lamba for the day. Oh, it's Dasun Shanaka. Looks like an overseas player from Sri Lanka. Looks like he's going to be tough to get out. Oh, and Rasul picks up a third. Have we missed him all season? Possibly. Three for 26 in this game. Down leg as well. That's a, a wicket maiden. Wow, bold. Rasul causing all sorts of problems here. 112 for three. We still have Aman to bowl as well. That's in the air. Shanaka could be out. Should be out even. And he is. Quadri gets his first of the night. Brings Jonathan Rinchana to the crease. Pavez Rasul to R Renard. That's a good shot from Renard. That's going to be four. Rasul has indeed bowled out. See if he can... Uh, do anything. No, he 
Bowls a no ball, and it's a free hit, and it goes for six. It's very disappointing to see Martin's bowling really struggling. Oman into the attack, and he bowls well. 153 for four. This match is well and truly still on here. Either way, 158 for four. Melvin's Chana. Oh, through the league side. Audrey bowling well with Aman. Might bring Sabia Khan back very soon. That's an edge in the air. Aman could have a wicket. And he does. He gets Lal Ranchana out for 22 of 31. Sin to the crease now. Aman to Sin. Can he go back to back? Oh, I thought he did. I thought he did, but no. Oh, that's well played, though. It just uses the pace for four. Quadri will bowl out his one-day season. That is a great shot. Aman to bowl nearing the death here, but he is good enough to bowl at any stage, really. Oh, my. That is a shot and a half, though. Maybe not. What a shot from Sin. And he's bowled him. Aman strikes back. There you go. Gone for 11. He has two for 22. Bacharji to the crease now. Sorry, it's actually Butter Chaudhry. Oh, he's gone. Butter Chaudhry has to go clipping the stumps. He's on a hat trick, but it is no run. Good stuff there. All right, time to spread the field for Sabia Khan. Well bowled from Aman. Three for 26. He's been... Exceptional tonight. Well placed edge. It's the 200 up. It's in the air. Sabia Khan could have a wicket, but it's going to go for six. Would you believe it? Going to bowl full. Full and straight. It's an edge. Oh, he's found the gap too for four. That's very lucky. Sabia Khan will bowl again to Renard. In the... Oh, past square leg for four. Sabia Khan. It's a free hit. That's four. Can he get his first one-day wicket is the real question here. No. That is a shot. And he's been, well, carted in the end for 54. Not great stuff. 241 for 7. That's on strike. And he's gone. Yadav picks up his first of the day. In the air from Das. It will probably go for 4. Oh, it just goes for the 1, actually. The fielder comes around. Gone! Renard is gone! For 78, Yadav strikes. Can he get a third? Yes, he does. He's edged it through his legs. They're all out for 242. And Yadav, 3 for 39. Rasul, 3 for 39. And Aman, 2 for 28. Quadri, 1 for... Good stuff there. In the end, 242 all out. And there's actually a chance of victory on the cards here. Good stuff from Bihar. All right, now I've got to go out and bat. And we need 4.9. So basically, 5 per over. Das to open the bowling to Kumar. Now, we don't know these Kumars very well, so we'll see how they go today. We've got Indrajit Kumar, and I don't know which is which. I do apologize about that. That's a great shot from Kumar, though. That is four. I'm not quite sure yet, as of yet, which one it is. That's a great shot again. Four more. That is Mishanth on strike now, and dabs that away nicely. Good shot for four. Swing and miss. Oh, he's gone. Indrajit Kumar has to depart. Just got it to jag back. Das, and he's gone. Kaiba Lamba, number three, the captain for today to the crease. 20 for one. Great shot from Kumar down the ground. Good stuff from him. Oh, just beats the dive for four. Down the ground again from Kumar. Lamba on strike. Great shot off the back foot through the covers for four. Oh, it's a beauty. Ends the fielding restrictions. We've done pretty well, actually. Thanks to Nishant Kumar. 29 of 30. Just kept the scoreboard ticking over. And the rate has not gone up nor down. Five and over it has crossed over too. Can up things a bit with this partnership building. That's around the wicket to Lamba. Oh, Lord, that's a shot for six. What a shot from Lamba. That's to Kumar again. Oh, a bit of a... French cut, if you will, down to fine leg for four. You take it. Both players nearly fully set in, fully settled in now. That's a nice uppercut from Lamba for four. It's the only three for one for Biha. Lamba. Oi. That's going to go well over for four. Edges over the slips for four. Streaky, but you get, you take it when you get it. Oh, that's a shot from Nishant Kumar for six. What a shot. That is him up to 46. This is on his one-day debut as well. I must mention that. 4.5 needed per over, and we are well and truly on track. The par is 56 at the moment. Lambda's going to just whack that away fine for four, and I think might be a 50 to Lamba. Not entirely sure. That is definitely a 50 to Kumar, though. He will come back for two, and that will bring up his maiden one-day 50 on his... One day debut as well. Congratulations to him. And it's the fastest versus Tripura. Would you believe it? Good knock on debut. Really good stuff to see. Butter Chaudhry. 
about to charge. I can't say his name right now. He's got Kumar stumped for 52 or 56. Not great to see. It's a good innings on Taboo though, but he has to go. But I tell you what, that's only his second 50 in his entire career. Better Chargy. It's better Chargy. Okay, better Chargy to Cash. Yeah, comes in for his first game. Oh, cuts that away nicely for four. Good shot from him. We don't expect too much because his average is not very good. But we will see how he goes today. I'm hoping for the best for him. For his sake. Gee, look at the field they're surrounding him with too. Oh, and he just dispatches it anyway. What a shot. Back to Chargy to Kashyap, who sweeps that away nicely for four. He shouldn't normally be given a chance like this, so he'll be begging to try and take it with open arms. That's a great shot just past point for four. A dive, but in vain. Can he go again? Yep, it goes over him. One bounce four, 22 of 13. 22 of 13 for Suraj Kashyap. Would you believe it? From nowhere, just come into the middle of the innings, facing against spin, the hardest phase of the game in the one day format, and he's dominating it. Nicely, 27 of 17. Unbelievable stuff. We're well and truly in control of the run rate, which is just four and over, which is a boundary per over. 142 for two. Helped by Captain Lambert today, who again, is batting well, and I think that's his fourth back-to-back -back 50 in this format. Unbelievable stuff. That is his fourth 50 in a row, his fifth this season, averaging 44 as it stands right now. Fantastic stuff. He's been the rock to our batting, and he's been some pickup for Bihar this season. It's good to see. It's good to see him finally flourish as well, because I really did think at the start of the season he was underperforming to his standards, but he's gone now. Of course, as soon as I talk him up, goes for 54 of 58. Again, he doesn't kick on. He's made 550s, no 100 yet. So he'll be desperate in future games to go on and kick on for Bihar. But nonetheless, Jonathan, would you believe it? Jonathan Lalrinchana has decided, or at least not him, but the captains decide to chuck him the ball. Unbelievable to try and take a wicket. Here he comes, Lalrinchana. As a batsman, oh, and Kashyap's having none of that. Whacks him through point for four. His last ball of his spell. Oh, Kashyap sweeps it away. Four more. He moves to 45. Has he ever scored a 50? He's never scored a 50 in his entire career before. And here he is today, Kashyap, proving all his doubt is wrong. Ball to Kartik again. Swept away with power. Shot for four. 3.6 per over needed. And again, Kashyap's the one dominating. Lalavan Chan has given yet another over, though. Can he get Kartik out? No, Kartik whacks him through point for four. Good shot from Kartik. 3.5 needed per over. Lalrinchana gets a third over to Kartik. But Kartik again. Drives him off the back foot for four more. 176 for three. They seem to be clueless at the moment. And Kartik continues to make them look so. Four more. Lalrinchana to Kartik. Again. That's the same shot. Four times for four boundaries. Unbelievable. Vats is going to bowl out. Kashyap on 49. Can he bring up a 50? Yes, he can. He does it with a boundary as well. Well played, Kashyap. You have to say, you have to give him some credit because I didn't expect too much from him in this game. And he's come out and scored 50 at a very quick, quick rate. Look at that. He's beaten the record. Kumar at the top set it and he's already broken it. 42 balls for a 50 against Tripura. Good stuff from him. Shun Shanaka into the attack now. The overseas player for Tripura, and that's going to be four for Kartik. Again, Kartik's got to start in every single game he's played this season. It's been unbelievable. Unbelievable pickup for Bihar. Kashyap. He's got his 50, but he could be out. And he is. Oh, he'll be disappointed with that. Gone for 55 or 51, but he's played very, very well. Have to give it to him today. He's been exceptional. All right, Sarek Martin to the batting crease, but the weather, all of a sudden, it's got overcast. Butter Chargy. Comes into the attack. And that's a great shot from Kartik down the ground for four. That brings up the 200 for the loss of just four wickets. Martin, zero off nine. Can he get going? Yes. Through the offside for four. Good shot from Martin. And again, a repeat dose. Four more. 28 needed. Better chargey to Martin. Can Sarek Martin whack him away? He's tried. He should have holed out and he has for 10 off 18. He'll be disappointed. And to be honest, Tripura will feel that there's still a lifeline yet in this game if they can get Rasul out into the bowlers. 
But, wow. Parvez Russell, what a shot for four. Kartik on 38. Oh my goodness me. We have to replay that one. Look at this. You cannot... I've ne I don't think I've seen a shot like that in this game. Kartik, take a bow. 14 needed. 12 to win. For Bihar to claim an unlikely victory against Tripura. Shanika to Kartik. Cuts it away. He'll bring up a 50 of his own. I'll play Dinesh Kartik. His... How many has he got this season? His fourth 50 this season. Average is 51. Good season for him, has to be said. Russell needs a 6 to win. But to Chargy. Can he do it? Well, he'll whack it away. And it will be 4. So he'll need just 2 now. But to Chargy. Tossed up. Russell drives down the ground, and there it is. Bihar win by five wickets against Tripura. And that means that they do not qualify. That is a very, very upsetting for Tripura, for sure, because they do not qualify as a result of our win. But nonetheless, I guess we've made an impact on the final results for who finishes top two in our pool. And that's something we should be proud of, at least. Four 50s in this game. We should be very, very happy with our game today. Unbelievable. We had three bowlers take three and four batters get 50. Probably our best game of the season, to be honest. Cash Yap, the player of the match for 55 or 51, considering that is his first 50 in his entire professional career. He is only 18 years of age. I do forget that. He's still got a long way to go in his career, that's for sure. And he got given an opportunity today and took it with both hands, that's for sure. Kumar as well. Nishank Kumar also managed to make his first 50. Lambert makes another 50. And Kartik, 52 not out to make a yet another 50 for himself there as well. 3 for 39 for Yadav. 3 for 39 for Russell. 3 for 28 for Aman. And Quadri, 1 for 41 as well. Nicely bowled. And Sabia Khan bowled well in patches as well. At the death, he got taken to a little bit, but he did bowl well up front. And yeah, guys, we win by 5 wickets. Unbelievable stuff. We, we will definitely take that. This is the final standings, as you can see, in the one-day trophy. Wasn't meant to be our season. We finish in 8th position, but we do actually finish above Railways and above Rajasthan, which is really good to see. And the same points as Tamil Nadu, who finished second last season. So that's really good to see as well. Which means Bengal and Madhya Pradesh will qualify for the next round. And with that, we will actually be simulating ahead to the T20 stuff and we'll be seeing who ends up the one day champions. And this is the T20 World Cup going on in the background, I believe, as well. Let's, let us just take a look at the fixtures and results for the one day stuff. Let's see who took it out in the end. Here we've got the quarterfinals. Jarkhand bet Chajishgar won against Odisha. I apologize about the pronunciations. I'm not very good at them. Bengal did beat Chandragar. Madhya Pradesh won their game against Uttarakhand. Good stuff to see. I made 127 not out of 109 balls. Real rock in their innings and Dubai. 70 off 37 as well. Okay, so then the semi-finals. Oh, Bengal beat Madhya Pradesh. Aya made 61 off 56, but it wasn't enough. They chased it down. Chadish Gar, 257 and 1, because they chased it. Okay, so that meant Bengal in the final against Chadish Gar, and they won. Bengal won. They won this, the whole thing. They ended up getting up. Saha, 112 not out. Iswaran, 56. Tawari, 68. And they got it done. Bengal were the one-day trophy champions. But guys, we are indeed going to be moving on to the domestic T20 trophy, which I'm very excited about in the next episode. We're going to be playing Andra. It looks like we're in a different pool to the one-day stuff, so that's going to be exciting. Actually, let me just go through the final statistics for the one-day trophy. Kishan, 692. Ezwaran, 678. Saha, 662. Thapa, 610. And Mukund, 577. Aya was there as well. 555 at 69.38. Very good stuff from him. Pratap Singh, 34 wickets at 16. Gunas Sekera, 27 wickets at 13. What a start to his one-day career. Dubey, 24 at 19. Pura Ral 24 at 21 and Sharma 22 at 17. For Bihar, we finished up Lamba 362 at 40, Kartik 357 at 51, Martin 251 at 41, and Rijnish 235 at 33. Honorable mentions to Kashyap, Kumar, both getting 50s, and Ranjan 74 average in his two matches as well. Quadri 
Top wicket taker, 13 at 29. Abhay Yadav, 11 at 22. Very good start for him in his career. Aman, 11 at 31. And a very, very good economy rate of 3.98. Very, very good. Data, 8. Corey Anderson, 6. Shout out as well to Russell for getting 3 in that last game as well. And with that, guys, this is the pool we have. We are in Group A for the T20 stuff. Each team plays six matches. Top two from each group goes goes through to the Super League. We're up against some very strong teams, including Uttarakhand, who do indeed have Guna Sekera in their lineup. So that's going to be very tough. Baroda were the runners up last season and also Karnataka made the quarterfinals. And it's going to be going to be very, very tough. And services as well, which I don't believe we may or may not have beaten them. I think they actually did beat us. They beat us in the end. That's right, they have um, Dwayne Bravo, so they're going to be a hard team to beat as well. It's going to be tough on the domestic T20 trophy, that's for sure. Then please make sure you leave a like, guys. Subscribe for more content such as this, guys. Don't forget to follow me on my social medias down below in the description. Join my Discord server, hit the post notification bell, and I will see you all in the next episode. And until then, guys, goodbye for now, guys.